What's up guys, welcome back to another video. Welcome back to a not so sunny day out. It is unfortunately raining today. Uh, we got a pretty good day yesterday. It was a little chilly, but it was, it was pretty good for the most part. So today marks the sixth episode of the Hot Wheels mini series. Like I said in the last video, I don't even know if I should call it a mini series anymore because yeah. uh, we've yeah. just been kind of making a habit out of it. As long as I can get the supply of Hot Wheels, we'll do the videos. Um, and as you guys may have just heard Chloe, she didn't say Binks, she didn't say Angel, and she certainly did not say Daisy. And that's because we have a new member of the family. Chance, come here. Hi, buddy. Oh, a little nose bump for you guys. So he is six months old. We just got him Friday. Uh, we went to go visit him through a friend of mine uh, who actually met in the car community uh, in Boston. Good boy. Um, Good his name was originally Dobby, uh, kind of remind, remind, reminded us of Harry Potter, uh, but we decided to rename him to Chance. Whoa! Okay, yep, alright, yep, okay. Ow! Okay, I'm sorry, you pulled it too hard! <laughs> As you can see, he's a little punk. He's only six months old, believe it or not. Um, <laughs> but this this dog was really a blessing in disguise. He's amazing already. He's very well behaved and really it's all thanks to my friend Christian um, Who got him to be this way without him? Easy. We don't know where oh. like how the dog would be behavior or anything like that He's very good with other dogs children other people like he's just overall Easy. amazing Easy. We brought him out to PetSmart yesterday and he didn't bark he didn't growl He didn't really do anything to anybody or any other dog so we are very thankful to have him in the family and we look forward to having him in the videos to come. So based on, I don't know what that's based on, but we're gonna go grab some Hot Wheels real quick. Don't mind the spare room. Oh, come on in. Don't mind the spare room. It is actually a lot better than what it was before. But here we have our two boxes of Hot Wheels. We have 20, in this box, I think it was, yeah, 20 or something like that in this box. And we got another 10 in this box. Come on. Come on. Come on, Chance. Good boy. So we're going to do the box of 10 for tonight. And that's how much we open in this mini-series. If you guys are new, we do 10 a night every week. And uh, so far, the most valuable cars and the rarest cars we've gotten are three miles variety MC 12s. Uh, and I think three or four Bugattis, if you guys would like to see those, if you go back to my previous videos um, and check those out, I would highly appreciate that. But without further ado, I'm going to get you guys mounted up onto this tripod and we'll get this mini series started. Oh. Alright, so with a little bit with the, 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 with a little bit of delay because of a pup, chance. It flows, babe. Oh, okay. Chance just decided to get into the litter box. Oh my god. Why don't you just take it off? Litter box. Um, Cause why not, right? So here we go. The beginning box for these Hot Wheels. And I don't know if I'm just having a stupid moment or if I actually can't figure out how to get Ooh, this box catch. open. I don't think I can actually figure. All right, hold on. We never really mentioned it in vlogs, vlogs from before, but we've been waiting to get a dog for like the past couple of years. Um, and we finally have one. We're just so blessed to finally have a dog and we don't think a better dog could have come along than him. If the people who sent this to us are watching, you guys did an amazing job with packaging. Like, I don't want to say over the top, because it's not really over the top, Thanks, but- your booty out. You guys did a really good job. I really appreciate that. Keep up the good work with how you package stuff. Holy crap. Packing peanuts, bubble wrap. Look at that, guys. That's amazing, actually. Thank you very much. Ooh. He's fine, man. I didn't get that close. Right, so here we go. So we have, we don't have all 2007 series this time. We actually have uh, 2007, 2008, and 2009. So we will have an opportunity to get 
different cars. Now, I don't know, I'm not very educated in what comes to the 2008, 2009 cars, but I'm very curious to find out. And I'm pretty sure this is the pack of 20 cars, not the pack of 10, which that's fine either way. All right, listen here, Linda. You wanna help? Oh my God. Chance, too much honey. He gets very excited with the cats. The cats don't really appreciate Chance. it, but. Um, they've been doing no. they've been doing very well so far Wait, including the bunny. He's actually he's not aggressive to the rabbit at all um, He's very gentle with her. He gets a little too excited, which we we watch him. So it's not a big deal but hey. She's the one that scratched your nose. Why do you want to be with her? Kind of weird these all have a blue sticker on the bottom I've never seen that before so let's see, we have... Back it up, my darling. I'm gonna get all these situated real quick, guys. It'll come right back to you. All right, so we might have a little bit of background noise because of uh, Chance and the cats. As I said, they do get along, but sometimes he's a little too much for them. But we have 13 2009 Hot Wheels here. We have seven 2002, wow. Seven 2007 Hot Wheels here. Um, I think we might do five and five, or yeah, we might do, yeah, screw it, we'll do five and five. So here we go, we're going to start out with this pile here. First, 2009 Hot Wheels, here we go. That's weird. That is so weird. Don't. Be sassy. It's kind of cool. It looks like a hot rod type car. Looks like it has a V8. Uh, this is called Rat Bomb. R A T B O M B. That's different. So, me and Chloe have been thinking about starting up a different type of series, including hot, uh, not hot wheels, um, half dollars. Uh, silver hunting are looking for proof car uh, my god proof coins not cars um, Chance. So that might be a video that will be sampled in the future But uh, here we have a Ford GT XI which I'm bad with uh, What am I trying to say not Roman numerals. Yeah, that's Roman numerals, right XI? Yeah, okay That's six. Yeah or 11. <laughs> Chance so we have a GT40 right here. Oh my God, a Ford GT <laughs> XI. Uh, don't mind me guys, we haven't gotten much sleep lately. This is really cool, I like the paint scheme on this car a lot. Come on, focus, there you go. That's super cool, I love it. We have a repeat of the rat bomb. Nothing too special. Chance. He's by your wire. Hey, back up. Back up. Can you be a good boy? Ooh, so that's weird. Mm. It almost looks like it has. Chance. Yeah, those are. I'll see if I can get it close enough for you guys, but those are actually revolvers mounted on each side of the car. Bless you. You guys can see the uh, the barrels, or the yeah the barrels. That's pretty cool. And this is called the shell shock. Pretty fitting. That's cool. Yeah, I do like that. The last one of the 2009 before we head on to the 2007s. Wow, this actually, so this is a matte finish. That's pretty cool, that's different. I haven't seen anything like this yet. <laughs> Relax. I don't know if this is, let's see what it is. Oh, this is a 06, nope, 08 Ford Fusion. 
It's got a, like I said, it's got a matte finish to it. It actually feels kind of rough. Um, I do like the flames on the side. That's pretty cool. Instead of the ghost flames, it has the regular flames. Focus. Yeah, I can't really get it in there for you guys, but that's what it looks like. Pretty cool. It's got red accents everywhere. It's got a, um, it's got a red decal on the hood of it. So that wraps it up for the 2009 for tonight. And here we go to the five. 2007s. We're hoping for a Bugatti or a Maserati MC12. Is there anything special in 2009s? I don't know. I'll, I'll have to do my research. Uh, look it up. See if there is. I'm sure there is. I think there's different kind of Bugattis in 2009s, but I don't know. No, no, no. That's not my story. So this is another repeat for the 2007s. We have a couple of these. Uh, it's called Rapid Transit. Not a big fan, but oh well. Come on. Oh, here we go. Another. I believe this is a Barracuda. Ooh, Barracuda. Wait for it. <laughs> and. Yep, no, the Plymouth Barracuda, and I mentioned in the first or second video uh, that some of these <laughs> <laughs> some of these cars, the bottom actually bubbles out. <laughs> it is all the uh, all the Plymouth Barracuda. Let's see if I can't get it. You guys can see it kind of bubbles out on the bottom, so that actually pre prevents the car from rolling. It moving like it should. Indoor voices. So it's not very, it's not a good track car if you guys decide if you want to play with it or whatever. It's not a very good car for the track. I know you want something alive to play. We have a brand new car here. Hey. hey. Never seen this car before, so I have no idea what it's called. The name of it is Callaway C7. So based on the C7, I don't know if that's some kind of like a. A variant of the Corvette C7. It doesn't look like a Corvette whatsoever. Um, if you guys know anything about this car, anything more than I do, which is nothing, uh, comment down below. And let me know. Apparently, the spoiler you comes were gonna off. Knock something out. Yeah, if you guys know anything about this car, comment down below. I'm very curious. Um, unfortunately, my battery light is flashing, so if it dies, I will have to. Obviously, stop for now no and then uh, charge Drop your battery it. for a little Drop bit and pick you guys back up. Drop it. But here's car number nine. Good. Just kidding. Car number eight for tonight. Leave it. Leave it. We have another Plymouth Barracuda. I actually like these cars a lot, especially the red and the black. Chance. It's very cool. I love them. I think the black's my favorite, though. <laughs> Don't bark at her. Let's see, we have two, four, six, seven. So this is actually, yeah, I was right. Car number, this is car number 10 for tonight. That last one was car number eight. Apparently I can't count very well. And Chance is messing with the rabbit just a little bit. He's just looking at her cage. Yeah. And we have yet again, another Plymouth Barracuda. I don't mind getting duplicates of these because like I just said, I do like these a lot. Um, I think they're very unique. Not very good track cars, but we're gonna probably end up putting these in uh, resident epoxy molds. But that's what we have for tonight, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed that quick unboxing of the 10 Hot Wheel cars. Five 2009 with five 2007s. Now, unfortunately, er, unfortunately, we did not get any, by the way, we unfortunately did not get any uh, Bugattis or Maserati MC12s. Not a big deal. We're not always going to get that lucky. Yeah. I am pretty satisfied with, with, with what we got tonight. Um, I'll get some quick footage of the pup for you guys. And uh, we'll end it shortly after that. So actually, before I forget again, and before we get some shots of this little crazy thing, um, i got to clean this stuff up. But I actually forgot that we have some stuff from Tanner Fox to open which is right here. So I actually missed 
a couple things from Tanner Fox. Uh, I put in my last video. I could not, unfortunately, I couldn't get a screenshot um, of the the merchandise that we missed. But uh, this kind of makes up for it a little bit in a way. Not really, because I'm still kind of disappointed about that. But we got these instead for probably a fraction of the price. Um, but we're gonna get all this stuff cleaned up real quick, and then we'll show you guys what's in this package. All right, so Chloe's actually gonna do us the honors and open up this package for us. <clears throat> Let's see what we have here. He's being a little weird, I was shooting on his ball. He's such a good dog. He's very well behaved for only being six months old, and a lot of the people that we ran into were very impressed with how well behaved he is. So let's see. Block. I don't care if I show the price, but I gotta block out my address and all my information. So Tanner Fox, twenty dollars. You guys know my name, but you don't know where I live, and uh, kind of like to keep it that way for now. What? So here we have it, guys. We have the T Fox poster set signed by Tanner Fox himself. And Guaxilla, of course. Focus, focus. There we go. Signed it twice here. Oh, that's pretty cool. These pictures came out so nice, which I, I don't expect anything less from Tanner because he's very good at what he does, and he doesn't accept anything subpar. Focus. Oh. And that's it. So eventually I am going to get these all framed um, at a store that's somewhat close to us at Blackstone Valley. Uh, I do have a couple other posters from Tanner Fox that are signed as well. Uh, so eventually I'm gonna get them all framed up nice. Maybe in something like what's on the wall there. All right guys, so it's been a couple hours. Since my camera died, I had to charge the battery. But I think I got in what I wanted to say before it did die. I want to put those T Fox posters um, in a frame like this, and that is actually a hand painted painting um, from somebody in Finland of a picture of my mom. Um, but we're actually gonna get ready to eat dinner here pretty soon. Um, we we've got a car show coming up this Sunday, so a week from today. So that should be fun. We're gonna bring Chance with us. And we're going to meet Ryan and Sam there, and maybe a couple of other people. Um, and as I said earlier about the half dollars, uh, as you can see here, I have $50. $50 and half dollars. Uh, unfortunately, there was no silver or mint coins or anything like that. Or uh, proof coins, I mean. But it is a good possible chance of us getting into half dollar hunting. Half dollar hunting and finding silver or really cool rare coins. Okay. If that's a series, mini series that you guys would like to see, let me know down below. Um, there's a few things that we have to get situated before we can actually start doing that because I'm going to buy boxes of uh, 500 coins, $500 coin. I'm going to buy $500, $500 worth of half dollar coins. What she said. Um, can you grab this? So if that's an idea that you guys want to want to potentially see in the future let me know i'll try to make that happen like i said it's going to be a little bit before i can make that happen um, grab the rice and i believe on that note Honey. the hot wheel series Never mind. the hot wheel series is gonna to have to come to an end soon it's gonna suck for a little bit but that's just how it has to be i want to try to get something else for you guys going um but if you guys like this video smash that thumbs up button uh, if you haven't subscribed already please consider subscribing. We do have better content coming with the nicer weather rolling around, finally. Um, yeah, so subscribe. If you do subscribe, I give you a subscriber shout out. You'll be posted somewhere on the screen. I don't know where. Um, comment down below any ideas that you guys want to see us uh, put into the videos in the future. And we will see you guys next time.